And this week, mortgage rates hit their highest level since 2009. Freddie Mac reports the 30-year fixed rate mortgage averaged 5.27 percent. This time last year, we were looking at rates just below 3 percent. The upward trend is the fastest pace in decades. The rise in rates is due to the Federal Reserve yesterday raising interest rates by a half percent, the biggest hike in the last 22 years. Officials say the move is meant to fight inflation, but it could also have an impact on that mortgage and credit card bills. News 12 Connecticut Sean McCabe has more. It's a short-term interest rate, federal funds, right? It is the interest rate between two banks. Put simply, the Federal Reserve's half a percent interest rate increase will make it more expensive for Americans to borrow money which can be as simple as your grocery bill with your credit card, to your car, to your houses. Sacred Heart economics professor Kawaja Mamoon says the increase you'll see on your credit card bills will likely be much higher than half a percent. People will have some bad months coming and um, maybe some belt tightening required. Mortgage rates have climbed from the mid twos to the high fives over the last few months, even as many buyers are still priced out of the market. So that's not good for consumers, but it is not good to have a high inflation rate either. So there's no way for us to not feel the pain. The mortgage experts here at Main Street Mortgage in Stratford say locking in your rate is a great idea, but they say if you wanted to get ahead of the current bump in mortgage rates, you would have had to act months ago. We've already jumped up. So our rates have pretty much gone up over two to two and a half percent since January. Broker David Bigley says variable rate mortgages are starting to make a comeback as current rates start looking less attractive. People are looking at variables again saying, hey, if I can maybe get a rate in the fours, I save myself 1%, I'll take the risk. But he's expecting rates to climb higher before they level off. My feeling is lock the rate in now um, and don't look back because it could continue to go up, you're going to be happy. If it goes back down, you're going to be upset, but it's a gamble. In Stratford, Sean McCabe, News 12, Connecticut. Well, the Fed says another half percent rate hike on the table for their next meeting in six weeks.